Carlos Yulo's performance at the Paris 2024 Olympics was nothing short of breathtaking. This young Filipino gymnast has been on an incredible journey. When Yulo stepped onto the floor for the men's floor exercise final, there was a sense of anticipation in the air. Everyone knew he had the talent, but this was his moment to truly shine, and he did just that. Where 24-year-old Filipino sensation Carlos Yulo, who spect- Yulo's routine was flawless. From start to finish, he moved with a level of precision and grace that left the judges and the audience in awe. His dismount, a three and a half twist, was executed so perfectly that it seemed almost effortless. That's the thing with Yulo, he makes the impossible look easy. When the scores came in of 15.000, it was clear that history had been made. Yulo had just become the first Filipino man to win an Olympic gold medal in gymnastics, and it didn't stop there. The very next day, Yulo competed in the vault final and once again delivered a performance that will be talked about for years. His explosive power and impeccable technique earned him another gold, making him the first Filipino athlete to win two gold medals at a single Olympics. These victories are significant not just for Yulo, but for the entire Philippines. It's a moment of immense national pride, showing the world that Filipino athletes can compete and win at the highest levels. Gymnastics experts have been raving about Yulo's technical prowess. His routines are packed with difficulty, but it's his execution that truly sets him apart. Every move is clean, every landing is solid. What makes Yulo extraordinary is his ability to combine power with finesse, a rare combination in gymnastics. His performances at Paris 2024 were not just about winning medals, they were about setting a new standard for excellence in the sport. Now, as much as we should be celebrating Yulo's historic achievements, the media has unfortunately shifted its focus to something far less inspiring. His public feud with his mother, Angelica Poquiz Yulo. I'm sure you've seen the headlines and social media posts. It's as if people are more interested in the drama than in Yulo's incredible success. The feud centers around some pretty personal issues. Finances, family dynamics, and even Yulo's girlfriend. His mother has been vocal about her concerns, and Yulo hasn't held back either. He even took to TikTok to express his frustrations, asking where his prize money had gone and defending his girlfriend against his mother's disapproval. It's all very public, and frankly, it's overshadowing the amazing things Yulo has accomplished. In Filipino culture, family is everything. There's a strong expectation that children will always respect and obey their parents, no matter what. So when a family dispute like this plays out in the public eye, it becomes a huge deal. The media, always hungry for a juicy story, has latched onto this feud, and it's taken the spotlight away from Yulo's Olympic victories. It's a shame, because the focus should be on his hard work and dedication, not on his personal struggles. The whole situation has sparked a broader conversation about how much of an athlete's personal life should be open to public scrutiny. There's a fine line between reporting on a public figure and invading their privacy. And in Yulo's case, it feels like that line has been crossed. People are forgetting that behind the gold medals is a young man who has worked incredibly hard to get where he is today. He deserves to be celebrated for his achievements, not dragged through the mud because of a family disagreement. Egg displays earned him two gold medals at the Paris Olympics. Carlos Yulo's historic triumph at the Paris 2024 Olympics has been met with both admiration and controversy. Fans and media around the world have celebrated his double gold win, recognizing the sheer talent and dedication that propelled him to the top. Yet amidst this celebration, there's been an unfortunate shift in focus toward Yulo's personal life, particularly his very public feud with his mother. This family drama has captivated some parts of the media overshadowing the incredible athletic achievements that should be at the forefront. Many fans are frustrated by this distraction, calling for the media to refocus on Yulo's accomplishments rather than the sensationalism of his personal disputes. Even journalism experts like Professor Danilo Arao have weighed in, criticizing the media for blurring the lines between public interest and invasive gossip. The consensus among many is clear. Yulo's Olympic success deserves to be the main story, free from the noise of personal controversies. 
Carlos Yulo's success at the Paris 2024, Olympics has not only earned him global recognition, but has also led to a flood of rewards and honors from his home country. After securing two gold medals, Yulo was showered with gifts that range from substantial cash bonuses to luxurious property and even lifetime supplies of his favorite foods. The Philippine government awarded him 20 million pesos, while corporate sponsors went all out, offering everything from a fully furnished condo to unlimited buffet meals. These rewards are a reflection of the immense pride the Philippines feels in Yulo, who has become a symbol of national achievement. His public image has been further elevated, solidifying his status as a national treasure and inspiring future generations of Filipino athletes. These honors are more than just prizes. They're a testament to Yulo's hard work and a reminder of what's possible with determination and support. In a country where sports heroes are rare, Yulo's story is a beacon of hope and pride, resonating far beyond the world of gymnastics. Carlos Yulo's journey to the Paris 2024 Olympics is a story of grit, determination, and unyielding perseverance. While his double gold victory is now the headline, getting there was anything but easy. Yulo's path was filled with challenges and setbacks that would have made a lesser athlete quit, but he kept pushing forward, showing the world what true resilience looks like. He became the first Filipino man to win two golds at the Olympics. Yulo's early career was marked by promise, but also by the harsh realities of competitive gymnastics. He first gained international attention in 2019, when he won gold on the floor exercise at the World Championships. Becoming the first Filipino to do so, it was a breakthrough moment, but it also came with the weight of expectations. Everyone was looking to see if this young gymnast could continue to perform at the level. The Tokyo 2020 Olympics was a turning point for Yulo, but not in the way he had hoped. Despite the hype, he struggled with consistency, and his performance didn't match the high hopes that had been placed on him. He didn't medal, and for many athletes, that could have been the end of the road. But for Yulo, it was just another obstacle to overcome. He took those disappointments and used them as fuel, working even harder to refine his skills and strengthen his mental game. Leading up to Paris 2024, Yulo faced more challenges, including injuries and the pressure of living up to his potential. Yet, through it all, he never lost sight of his goals, his perseverance paid off when he delivered two flawless routines that not only won him gold, but also cemented his status as one of the best gymnasts in the world. What's remarkable about Yulo is how he has evolved both as an athlete and as a person. He's learned from his setbacks, grown stronger with each challenge, and emerged not just as a champion, but as a role model for future generations. In the Philippines, sports, particularly gymnastics, haven't always been given the attention or resources they deserve. Yulo's triumph is changing that narrative. His victories have shown that with the right support, Filipino athletes can compete and win on the world stage. There's now a growing call for better funding, improved training programs, and more support for young athletes who dream of following in Yulo's footsteps. It's a shift that could have long-term benefits, not just for gymnastics, but for all sports in the Philippines. However, it wasn't just gold that he took home with him. Yulo left the Paris Games with more than just victories. Yulo's success also carries a broader cultural impact. For many Filipinos, seeing one of their own excel in a sport that has long been dominated by other countries is a powerful moment of national pride. It's a reminder that Filipinos can stand shoulder to shoulder with the best in the world and that talent knows no borders. Yulo's achievements are helping to change perceptions, both at home and abroad, about what Filipino athletes are capable of. On the global stage, Yulo's journey is reshaping the narrative around Filipino athletes. No longer seen as underdogs, they are now recognized as serious contenders. Yulo's story is being told far beyond the Philippines, inspiring athletes worldwide and shining a light on the potential that lies within every country, no matter how small or underfunded. It's a powerful message that resonates far beyond the world of sports. 
In many ways, Yulo's impact goes beyond what happens in the gym. He's become a symbol of what's possible when determination meets opportunity. His success is sparking change, inspiring dreams, and proving that with the right mindset and support, anything is possible. As the world continues to celebrate his achievements, one thing is clear. Carlos Yulo is not just a gymnast, he's a game changer. So, what are your thoughts on this? Let us know in the comments below.